G'day YouTube. So I've got my fourth panel. Uh, the rail's still sticking out because my fold up one, which I put up there temporarily, will be going over there. I just gotta buy the the bolts to put in there. And the wind turbine is down for maintenance. Uh, I got my finally got myself a MPPT charge controller. Uh, earlier today, before I put the laptop on, it was at float. So that's how much uh, watts is coming through from the panels above the chev. Uh, this charge controller now is the panels above me. This charge controller is for the 120. Uh, and I basically labeled them with some white out, uh, white white ink. So it's sort of jumping around a little bit, so it's between 17 and 18 amps. Nothing on the wind turbine, because that's down. So what I've done is I've got the output on this, comes into here, through here. So both these charge controllers go into here. So that's combined. And I've turned those panels into, made them into 24 volt. So that's how many amps in 24 volt. And then that's how many amps the MPPT changed to. So I think it's more efficient doing it in 24 volt and then put it through an MPPT to bring it down to, you know, 12 volt system. So this is still hooked up and all. Um, got myself new batteries. I definitely want to try and get another two, but they're not cheap. They're from eSolar. And that's basically the specs of them. They're a 200, and 200 amp hour battery, which I don't know if you can see too well. Um, I got myself, I think it's zero gauge, so I'll eventually, I'll eventually do the rest with it. Everything else is roughly the same, it's just got brand new batteries, got a new charge controller, I put up my big inverter, which this side's not plugged in because it'll put power in. Everything's roughly all the same. Uh, that's how many watts I'm pulling out at the moment. Or using, should I say. Um, got myself a, a Ryobi Whippersnipper, which is not bad. And I also got myself a electric lawnmower, so... That's basically all the news. Um, yeah, my lattice is doing really well. Caterpillars are really munching away on that. It's damn annoying. Same with the lattice. But that's just with bush border. So uh, it's that lattice that you can pick off a leaf whenever you want it. Um, I put that uh, caterpillar dust on here, but yeah, they still keep coming along and getting that. Uh, same with this, I put the stuff on there, which yes, yeah, so I'll be harvesting that at some point. I won't be taking it all, and that's basically it, YouTube. So.
that'll be my next one. Shift that to there. I am quite happy with the MPPT charge controllers. I don't know why, she always seems to like this spot. That's right where my berry bush is. Blueberry bush. Away. Luna, away. Which I don't like her being on here, so I might have to fence this area off a little bit. Uh, even though it's winter, it's um, flowering. We had some weird weather. It feels more like spring. Same with these. I think these are starting to get some uh, as well. It's my peach donut. And that's pretty much it. Everything else is doing quite good. So I'll probably cable tie those up to make it look a bit nicer. But I just wanted to see the difference between running it as 12 volt or running it as 24 volt and I notice I get more watts doing it that way a bit more efficient so that's it YouTube catch you on the next lot so doing pretty good today Batteries are at float. So much the inverter's pulling. String of above me. And I've got the laptop on as well. There is more content to come, so like it, hate it, subscribe. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. I'll catch you all on the next one. Thanks and bye.